If you are in a relationship and you're thinking about how to relate a secret to your partner and you're so skeptical about it, this video is for you. Hey lovelies, well, welcome to my wonderful channel this day. And if today is your first time of coming to this channel, kindly give this video a thumbs up. Kindly subscribe to this channel. You will see subscribe button there. Click on it and you subscribe. Then share my video. Share my video. My videos are not just there. So just let me just go and support her and go. They are very, very educative. I come here to educate. I'm glad men are testifying to what they've learned from this channel and how it has been making positive impact in their lives, in their union, in their marriage. In your relationship so if you are seeing this face for the first time this is Lorna the relationship um, expert so I have a lot to offer you both ones I'm yet to release and the ones already on my channel so you choose where you learn from always be here activate the notification bell so if I make an upload you could come to learn what's new I have to say then for the old ones I've said so far you can scroll down this channel Take your time, see any topic that appeals to you and listen. And anyone you watch you found interesting, you please share. That being said, <laughs> thank you, my dearies. A lady came to me and told me that a guy she has said yes to, a guy that has proposed her and she said yes to, she has accepted to marry this guy and she had to disclose a secret, a hidden secret. She has to open up this secret to this guy that a guy has used secret against her and dumped her. The guy she has said yes to, the guy proposed and she said yes. So she now had to disclose a kind of a hidden secret she, she has hid for some years they have been in a relationship. But now she thought since the guy has proposed and she said yes, so it's going to be family. She had to expose, she had to tell this guy the secret of hers and the guy used it against her is it right no it's not right this is absolutely out of it a lady you've claimed you loved and because she cannot keep secrets from you you know i've been an advocate of don't hide anything from your partner by the time you know it has gotten to the stage of yes I want to marry you. Can you marry me? You say yes. I've always advocated. Don't hide. Not ever. I don't say you should disclose everything. To let there be some restrictions. Things you know are so confidential that has nothing to do with that marriage. But adventure, it takes you people to that level. If this secret has nothing to do with it, don't. I've always said this. But I say if it has to do with the relationship, the marriage, don't hide it from him don't hide it from her you know especially when it has gotten to <laughs> you know it's not funny when it has gone to the stage of i want to marry you and you said yeah two of you are not planning on how to tie the knots together so there are some things you can't keep from him things you can't keep from her now she just did something we thought could have been wise any reasonable and responsible man should have commented rather he used against her and dumped her is it right? It's not right. Honestly, it is absolutely wrong. It's not like she killed someone. No, she didn't kill someone. That was supposed to be personal. But she just said, well, let me say this. Because if we get into marriage, something might prompt him to discover. And it might be that I've lived a fake life or I hid something from him for years. And I started to tell him, now he's going to be my husband. I've said yes to him. Let me tell him this. And the best he thought he could do was just use it against her and dumped her. He has now exposed this secret. It was supposed to be for the two ears. Her ear and the guy's ear. Now, the guy has exposed this. The guy has let people out. They know this secret. Yet, he dumped her. The lady. In the name of um, I can't marry her. This is what she did in the past. This is what she did in the past, and because of that, I don't want to do with having to do with her again. Let her go. You expose this secret. You let people. You escalated the secret and still dumped her. You think you, I confronted the guy? He said he was doing it just for people to know why. Because people were asking him why he can't do further. I said don't owe anybody any explanation for any reason you don't want to go further with her. Please, this 
trying to walk again. Let's part our ways from here. But we are supposed to keep her secret for her. If she never trusted you, she wouldn't have told you this. The guy had to escalate this and dump the guy. So now what if we start saying, don't tell them anything until you get into marriage. And someone would say, why did you keep this from him? You are wicked. You are this. You are that. Then they might push this person out of marriage after she must have come in. Because she kept this secret from this guy and waited till she come in. Now she said, let me say this. This is what we've been preaching. Don't hide it from him. Hide it from her. Let me say this before I get in there so that it wouldn't be like I hid it from him. Now he has just escalated it used against her and dumped her. Is it right? No, it's not right. As far as I'm concerned, that guy isn't man enough. That guy isn't guy enough. He isn't responsible. It's even a good thing he dumped the lady. He dropped, in fact, I can't use dump. So she using it, he, he, he dumped me. No, he dropped you because you aren't his type. You aren't compatible because he is the talking type. He doesn't keep secret. He isn't responsible. So what I now console the lady, I said, mm -mm. you know, calm down. Go out, don't worry. Escalating that is letting God know that this thing, something cannot be kept safe in his hands. And God saw it and said, no, my daughter, come out. There is someone good for you. That person will hear it and still say, it doesn't matter. Because for you, it is so wise and so good of you to have let him know this. Any responsible guy out there that hears it should blame him and accept you. And I asked her to wait. Calm down. Your own would come. When he comes, he must have heard this somewhere that this story may even lead to him coming to you. Because some guys now need a truthful lady. Someone that to, that are just transparent. That's what you did. That to push you out of this place, you're going to push you to the right place. That's someone that would acknowledge and appreciate what you did. This is where this situation is going to push you. And this is to happen to her. She's not the first nor second to experience this. And I'm talking to you guys out there. So you said you want to marry a lady, you propose her, and she has to tell you her secret. And the best you can do is to escalate. There's no problem. There's no problem. But if you get the type that would hide all the high double from you tomorrow and come in there, by the time you start discovering one by one, it does not concern her. She will ask her, eh, is she the first person? Will you tell me you don't have a secret? What would you do in that case? You start complaining, right? You start calling on relationship experts to come and mediate, right? Anyway, so if you think you are a, a man and you, you love a lady and you think um, it's better she hides something from you, so would you prefer it when she must have come in? Either she says it or you discover it yourself. How would you feel? How would you treat that? If you have this type of a lady, cherish her. Mm, welcome her. Do you understand? Grab her because her type is right. But if you think you can't hold your mouth, keep talking. Let's see the kind of woman you have in your mouth. So please, guys, when a lady steps to you and tells you her secret, if you can't take her because of that, fine. Tell her it can't work. Not to go and escalate this and still dump her. Yeah, tell her it can't work. Then keep the secret with you. She will go and find someone that would accept her with her mistakes. It is a past, not present. Now, you are forcing us to advise that ladies should, or guys should keep their secrets with them, don't tell anybody. If they discover, fine, I don't push that. But you are pushing us to do that. So that's not the right thing to do. What you did is so wrong, so, so wrong of you. But then maybe that is the way God wants to separate you because you are incompatible. I, I, I believe that's the way. So guys, if you see a lady that walks up to you to tell you her secret, grab her, please. Her type is red. And for any reason, like I said, and I repeat, if you can't do with her, fine. Drop her and move on. Don't escalate her secret. Don't disgrace her. Don't embarrass her. Yeah. Don't let everybody know what she thought she has confided in you. Don't let her feel that her secret isn't safe in your hand. But then, this kind of a guy, before you get a truthful person, is going to be red. Because God has seen your heart that you don't deserve someone truthful. So when you get someone fake, don't complain. Don't come and bother us. Hmm? Yeah. So please, we need your opinion. If you are in her shoe, what would you do? Is the guy right? What he did, is he right? Is he right? At least by escalating this, is he right? Well, 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 by dropping her, he might be that they aren't compatible, they aren't meant to be. But by telling people what she did, look at what she did in the past. Is it the right thing? 
to me it isn't the right thing this is the wrong guy to do with so ladies if you have a guy that talks too much wrong and if you are someone that this guy would come and tell you look at what this lady did if you are the type and you don't condemn him that, that he, his type might happen to you do you understand so please let someone secret be safe in your hands and if you can't do with it go but keep it safe in your hands don't escalate it and if anybody has done this to you don't worry you're going to get somebody better hmm? okay it's a good thing you did stop blaming yourself why did i do that don't blame yourself it's a good thing you did now he has known and drove for that it's better she he heard from you than to hear from someone else so advise her after that to move on someone better is going to come her way that guy isn't her type the guy talks too much if not now more probably in future when she moves in there the guy might be telling people how they sleep in the room how they do their things in the house so it's the best that thing god just pushed you out of him now so that your future wouldn't be so disastrous that's all for this video I advise her what do you suggest she does to move on i would have told her to move on she's like to let me go and beg the guy no don't beg him move on she isn't for you he isn't for you let him not go and cause you more damage in future more emotional damage in future so let him be and move on and guys if you can't keep someone secret well it's up to you when you get fake tomorrow enjoy it mm -hmm. so that's all for this video and i would appreciate it if you would give this video a thumbs up if we share this video so that it can help to shut up some people out there that have flippant tongue that talks everything that they see or they hear it's not supposed to be be for a guy it doesn't say one of a good and responsible guy well like i said responsible isn't sometimes come on so well that's all for this video i see you on my next video please drop your advice on the comment section don't forget to stay safe don't forget to mind what you say to people and don't forget to hold what people want you to hold for them don't talk too much mm? thank you i see you on my next video bye